hi guys welcome back to my channel in this video i'm gonna show you how we can transfer our whatsapp chat data from our old android phone to new iphone so you guys can see here i'm just going to transfer my old whatsapp data from my android to iphone so let's start without any problem let's proceed first of all guys you have to follow this whole process I'm just going to show you each and every single step in detail. So what you have to do just first of all, you have to reset your iPhone if you have just already set it up. Okay, so I'm just going to reset my iPhone XR first of all and you guys can see here now my iPhone will be erased and let it be and now in the Android phone what I have to do and you have to do the same steps you have to follow the same. Open the WhatsApp application in the Android phone. Just hold on. Okay, open WhatsApp application and just tap on these three dots. Click on this settings button as you guys can see here. Now just tap on this chats and here you have to tap on chat backup. Make sure you select your account first and then tap on Google Drive. Select your account basically and then tap on only one tap and click on backup and your whole whatsapp chat will be backed up without any problem so you guys can see here in my case my whatsapp chat is totally backed up now in your case you have to do it my chat is around 707 mb size so it is going to take a while so i'll just skip the process then open the play store in the android phone and just search for an application which is known as move to ios this app is from official apple so you guys can see here you have to download this app and after downloading just you guys can see here my iPhone is just got turned on and now just set it up but just pay attention here guys you don't need to set up it completely just wait for a while and let me show you the whole process now set your language select your region and now connect it with Wi-Fi and just bypass the activation lock so you guys can see here it's just showing appearance just click on continue button here and just select your wi-fi connection first of all and let me set up my wi-fi first of all and click on continue again and let me enroll with my password there you go and it's asking for apple id and account lock but i'm just clear good to go click on continue click on setup for myself click on setup later and don't use passcode right now but here pay attention here guys now you guys can see here transfer your apps and data button is here you have to transfer it from android you guys can see here at the fourth option you guys can see fourth is from android and here is showing the move to ios application it's asking to download in android and we have already downloaded it so we are going to open this application and make sure you tap on allow and you have to allow all the permissions okay make sure do not deny any type of permission here tap on find code here in the iphone click on continue and you will get your code and here this code same code you have to enter in your iphone do not enter my code in your case enter your iphone's code so you guys can see here my both phones are connected with each other it's asking to transfer data so make sure you just turn on only whatsapp here because i don't know maybe you just turned on any other thing and you will lose your data so just click on whatsapp and just click on start button here and it is preparing to transfer your whole data from your android to iphone okay so just wait for a while it's just loading it just depends the time depends upon the size of the whatsapp chat so i'm just going to skip this process because i'm having enough data so it will just take a while here so let me skip this process and that's it it is around 100 and there you go within a three seconds it will be completed and after that what you have to do just let me show you okay there you go almost done click on next button here click on continue button and it is showing transferring data to iphone and this process is also going to take around 15 to 17 to 18 minutes so just sit back and relax and make sure your iphone and android is on power plugged in so that it can be just normally turned on and make sure you use the stable wi-fi connection which is having proper fast speed 
and there you go my transfer is completed it took around 15 minutes so just click on done button here and the task in the android phone is completed now you can leave it and now in the iphone click on continue and here you can enter or enroll your apple id so just let me enroll with my apple id enter my sign in my apple id here if you have already apple id you can en enroll as i have already and click on continue button here and you guys can see here update your iphone just set up it completely and just jump to the home screen first of all and that's it now you guys can see here whatsapp is already available here but we have to download it first so now let's jump to the app store and here my account is already signed in because i have already signed in in the setup screen so let me show you there you go my account is already signed in here so now i will just jump to the app store and download whatsapp application here okay so just search for whatsapp and there you go okay okay uh, just download the app whatsapp app and now you have to enter your phone number and make sure you enter the same phone number which you were using in your old android phone just click on agree and continue button here and just enter your phone number and just let me show you after entering just you will get the two-step verification authentication code here so make sure you enter the authentication code you can receive authentication code in your old android phone whatsapp or in the uh, phone number okay so make sure you enter the verification code first of all so let me enter i just received it in my uh, phone number recent sms and that's it i just received it and you have to enter your verification code and after entering you need to follow the same process so you guys can see here i just entered my code here and just showing validating code so i just tried to show you the whole full process so that you cannot do any type of problems here it is asking for permissions make sure you allow full access now just showing importing and it will take around two to three minutes and after importing successfully your whatsapp is ready to go you can use your whole whatsapp like you were in the android phone you get the whole chat backup whole photos and voice messages if you want to include your videos you have to turn on include videos option in the android phone when you're just backing up your data so you guys can see here whole whatsapp chat is available here photos including so this was the very simple fix hope you guys find this method helpful thanks for watching stay tuned thank you so much guys